for this week's gotcha, I want to talk about the fight over firearms in this country with a special focus on Judge Roger Benitez, who recently overturned California's assault weapons ban. And in his opinion, his written opinion, he compared AR-15 guns to Swiss Army knives, describing both as, quote, the perfect combination of home defense weapon and homeland security defense equipment. Benitez has been widely criticized for the comparison, which is absurd on his face. Semi-automatic guns like the AR-15 are weapons of war, and a Swiss Army knife is a multi-use tool that typically includes a nail file, tweezers, and a corkscrew. But the larger story is what Benitez's ruling will mean for gun laws in this country and whether we're about to see a shift in Second Amendment interpretation by the courts. Contrary to the narrative pushed by the NRA and other gun lobbying groups, for most of American history, the idea that the Second Amendment guaranteed unfettered personal gun ownership was a non-starter. Indeed, well into the 20th century, the Supreme Court repeatedly ruled that the Second Amendment applied only to gun ownership within the context of a state militia. Former Supreme Court Justice Warren Burger, appointed by Republican President Richard Nixon, was asked about the NRA idea of unlimited gun ownership under the Second Amendment in 1991. This has been the subject of one of the greatest pieces of fraud, I repeat the word fraud, on the American public by special interest groups that I have ever seen in my lifetime. In between Chief Justice Berger's condemnation of unrestricted firearm access and Judge Benitez's decision last week, the United States has seen several cases that chipped away at common sense gun control measures. Perhaps most importantly, in 2008 with DC versus Heller, in which the Supreme Court, after more than 200 years of acknowledging limits on gun ownership, decided to scrap all that precedent and say that the Second Amendment guaranteed almost any individual's right to own a gun. There's no evidence that the Founding Fathers intended this at all. But even if there were, those men could not have conceived of the weapons we can wield today. Indeed, some of the deadliest mass shootings in history have been committed using the same gun Judge Benitez compared to a Swiss Army knife. And while Swiss Army knives are designed as multi-use tools, AR-15s and other assault-styled weapons and guns have a singular purpose, to kill and maim as many people as possible in as short a time as possible. With mass shootings on the rise, Judge Benitez's decision isn't just poorly argued and off-target, it's potentially deadly. I got you.